The holiday weekend has started. With all the celebrations comes extra heavy patrols by road and water to keep our local families safe all weekend long. Emily Bloom is live in beautiful Coeur d'Alene with how crews are planning to keep things safe. Emily. Yeah, Aaron, as you can see here behind me, law enforcement is set up and ready to go for the weekend, and they're already busy. They tell me that they're hoping to encourage smart decisions with the presence that they have right out here by the water. Well, we're going to head out on the lake, uh, maybe watch some fireworks. Not sure where exactly yet. For Ray Ann Higgins, the fun started about six hours ago. Yeah, we got off work early, and we're... Just going to go out and have a good time before the big crowds come in. She's ready to celebrate the 4th, and she's been looking forward to this weekend for a while. Uh, we're going to go tool around. We have a brand new, or not a brand new boat, but new to us. Okay. Um, so it's our first day out with it. Oh, yeah, we're going to go have some fun. They're making their best efforts to avoid the biggest crowds. Sure. We will stay away from the the other end of the lake where the fireworks go off because it gets a little crazy down there so we stick to this end of the lake and to stay safe what we don't want is people abusing the celebration of fourth of july and taking that just a little bit too far sergeant howard says you'll notice more boats on the water with extra kootenai county sheriff's patrols and the u.s coast guard helping out yeah we're trying to set the tone just let people know that we're out here you can see we have just these patrol cars here, that's just a small amount of actually who's uh, patrolling, not just Lake Coeur d'Alene, but all of the waterways in Kootenai County. They want everyone to have fun. They just want them to do it responsibly. If you're drinking, make sure to have a designated driver. Definitely some swimming. I imagine that'll happen. And some cocktails. <laughs> Patrol officers are reminding everybody to stay hydrated. They want to remind us that your body tolerates alcohol a little bit differently when you're out in these warm temperatures. Uh, as for the water temperature, only in the low 60s right now. Reporting live in Coeur d'Alene, Emily Bloom, 4 News Now. Emily, thank you.